Spiritual soul in the building, gazer. Nature, nature, soul in the building, man. Simple. Now check this out, man. So y'all gotta understand. Spiritual soul, I thought so. I thought my main channel, I thought I received more hate on my main channel than any other YouTuber in YouTube history. But Spiritual Soul is one of the most hated channels on earth right now. Not just from YouTube. The YouTube hate me. Of course, they censoring my channel. But not just from YouTube. I got spiritual, spiritual, other spiritual leaders that don't like me. You know, I didn't even know it was a such thing as hate in the spiritual community. I thought everybody was trying to escape the matrix. But shit, most niggas just trying to get their bag. They trying to eat. They need that money. So let me tell you this. I receive a lot of hate, man. And I, and I, and I, came, to the, I came to the realization most of the hate that comes to me, I steal their energy. It's about how you react to the hate, how you respond to the hate. It's about what you say. Understand that you could trick your. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna drop a video on how you can steal energy. Okay. I'm gonna drop a full video on how you can steal people energy. Bro, that motherfucking bug is here. Listen, yo, hey, shut up. Let a nigga record. You know what I'm saying? That's tough. Now listen. First thing first, so let me tell y'all this. So most people don't like what I do, but they still gonna watch, so I don't care. But one thing y'all gotta understand, man, a lot of people, bro, I get death threats, all type of shit. I use it to keep bringing, I use it, steal that energy and keep coming at y'all. I know how to protect my energy. I know how to take breaks from social media. Y'all gotta understand, social media catch more bodies than bullets, bro. Social media is their number one tool to run us. Social media, the internet. Bro, they didn't have the internet. They didn't have all this shit in the 90s, in the early 2000s, bro. It wasn't like this. We don't, bro, listen. We don't need the internet. We don't, but they created this reality for us to program us to make everything we see on the internet like it's something that's for us when in reality, this is the shit that's killing us. So look, let me tell you, if you somebody that feel like you have full control, you don't need to meditate. You don't need to go vegan. You are perfectly fine with your life. You got money and you live in your best life. If you feel like you are this person and you feel like you are fully in control of your life. Let me open your eyes for a minute, because if you somebody that watched this channel, you got to understand your vibration is we on the same vibration. If you could if you could relate to what I'm saying on this channel, y'all are on the same vibration as me. I'm no bigger than y'all, bro. At all. So understand this, if you watch my channel and you think you know everything, everybody has had a point in their life when they just sat there and just questioned something about this reality that we live in. My videos is to open your eyes for more stuff that you already knew. Y'all gotta understand, we already know this is a matrix. Our higher self already know, but our higher self is buried right now. Our ego has taken over. I just dropped a video about how you can connect with your higher self in two minutes. You will keep becoming your higher self and start learning everything about this matrix. So listen, let me tell y'all this. If you somebody that feel like you are fully in control and you can't get cloned, nothing. If you was a threat to them, you feel like you just immortal right now and you ain't even really taking care of yourself. Let me give you some reasons why you ain't really doing shit with your life, bro. You are, you are, a, a, you are a puppet, bro. You are a fully controlled by the matrix. No matter how much we think we moving forward, they always got 30, 40 plus years ahead of us. They always know what we are doing. Let me tell you, bro, I dropped a video. I, look, I'm not gonna talk about the 5G internet, okay? I already dropped videos about it. I'm not gonna talk about the GMO meat that y'all eat. I already dropped videos about it. I'm not gonna talk about the fluoride water, the poison water, I already dropped videos about it. I'm not gonna talk about motherfucking the fake clouds. I already dropped videos about it. I'm not gonna talk about all these things. I'm not gonna talk about, hey Siri is always listening. She's always waiting for you to, she's just waiting for you to say something to her. She's always listening. I'm not gonna talk about it. I'm not gonna talk about every time you record that red dot, the same red dot that's on your TV 24 seven, when it's on and when it's off. That same red dot, that's when you press that record button, that red dot right there. I'm not going to talk about that either. I'm not going to talk about it. I'm not going to talk about face recognition. Y'all know, we they already got our fingerprints, right? Now, it's go, it, it ain't going to be no more fingerprints. It's going to be face recognition. They're going to know where we at 24-7. We're going to have to unlock our phone with our face. That's the only way it's going to be able to unlock. 
Yeah, they, they got everybody in this world fingerprint already. We all have a social security number. We have a number to our life on this matrix. They gave us a number. So look, check this out. So if you somebody that don't feel like you being controlled, let me say this. Do you shop online 24 seven? You feel like you can't get cloned? You feel like you are above the matrix? Do you shop online 24 seven? Well, I just want you to know, they know your swag. They know what you like to wear. They know your drip from years and years and years behind. And now they know what you wear. They know what you like to wear. They know what shoes you've been buying online. You be on Fashion Nova? Bro, they see you getting all that Fashion Nova shit. So if they wanted to clone you, your clone will have all the information in the drip that you do on a regular basis online. They see what socks you like to wear. They see what type of tights you like to wear. Hmm, so I see she likes seeking these type of clothes. Hmm, she's more of a boy clothes type wearing. They see all the clothes and shit you've been buying on online, etc. from years ago. They know exactly what you like. They know exactly what you like. So if you somebody that shop online 24 seven, bro, you ain't, bro, listen. You be on the website shop. You be on the website looking at stuff. And then you get off that website and go on the app, Instagram or something. That same shit that was on that website will pop up on the app reminding you, come back. Am I lying? You be on the website searching some shit. And then you get off the site and go on Facebook or Instagram or whatever. And then them same, them same things you were searching up will pop up. Like somebody's watching you, right? They reminded you, come back, come buy this, come back. Did you forget? Head ass, right? Oh, another thing. I already talked about Google Earth. I ain't going to talk about Google Earth. I ain't going to talk about how they covering up the Google Earth shit for real surveillance cameras. Yeah, we see Google Earth. We see the pretty neighborhoods, the tall buildings, but they see us. <laughs> We're not going to talk about that, right? But you still think you in fully control. You, you think ain't nobody watching you. You think you above the matrix. You ain't got to meditate or nothing. You know everything already. They got your fingerprints, your face. Bro, is you somebody that... Another thing. You be on these apps 24-7, right? You be on Instagram and Snapchat and all this shit 24-7. Bro, they know what you like. They been seeing the type of girls you are seeking and that you like from years ago. They know what type of females, big booty females and all this shit you like. They see what your top, they see what you like. They see what girls you follow. So if you was to get cloned or something, it won't, it won't be a difference at all. They already know enough about you. Your clone will be perfectly fine with all the information he getting from you. You are feeding him. Google, we feeding Google. We ask Google all these different questions. We are feeding Google. How you do this? How you do that? Feeding Google these different questions. We are feeding the internet. They are feeding off of us. So you somebody that be on Facebook, Instagram 24 seven, liking all these pictures. You like all these girl pictures. They know what type of girls you like, but you still feel like you in control. Right? Y'all got to understand, nobody on this earth is doing, bro, listen, y'all motherfuckers ain't doing, nobody is doing nothing with their life, bro. Y'all motherfuckers is flying overseas, going back, forth, back, forth, back, forth. Nobody is going to Antarctica. Nobody is doing nothing different for hundreds and hundreds of years. Nobody is doing nothing different. We are like fucking rats and they looking down at us like these. Seeing how we react to shit, throwing all this shit in our face on movies, seeing how we react. So when it comes to life, they can go crazy. The people that sleep don't go crazy. Right. They know what you like to wear. They know what people they know what men you like. They know what men you are seeking online. You somebody that be on Google Maps. Our phone is already like a tracking device. It's a tracking device for them. They see us. They hear us and they know what we're talking about. I know I'm being watched. Duh. I know it's going to come a point in time. I'm going to have to face this type of energy face to face. And I've been prepared my entire spiritual journey for that moment. I'm more of afraid of a fucking bug than I am to die. That's the, that's the position I came in in my life now. 
I see a motherfucker crazy ass big bugs. They got it and, and, and they're down here in AZ. And I'm just creepy as fuck. But a motherfucker could walk up to me with a pistol or something. And it's like, bro, let's go crazy. Let's do it. I'm ready. My purpose is served. It's time to rebirth. It's time to go crazy. It's time for me to up my level of life now. And spread energy. And, and, and I'm going to be taking care of y'all while I'm gone. I have a strong soul. Boy, this smelling it crazy. I'm in the sun 24-7. I don't care how much fake clouds you put in the air. It won't affect me. I eat the sun 24-7. Understand that man, all these apps nigga we control. You be on Uber? You oh no, I don't use Google, Google Maps. I be on Uber. They bro, some the Matrix own Uber. They see where you're going 24/7. They see the locations you've been to in the past weeks, months, years. They see what family your family live at. They see them. Oh, she going here. Oh, she went there. Your clone to know where you been going. Your clone to know your friends. Hop in the lift. They know where you're going. You putting all your tracking, your information on Google Maps. They know where you're going. They see you anyway. Like I said, it's going to come a point in time. There will be no more fingerprints. They already got all our fingerprints. It went from putting in a four pass code to now fingerprints to now face recognition. They got all our face already. But y'all still think y'all not control. Y'all st still think y'all got full control over y'all life. You don't need to meditate or nothing. You just need to go to church and sit and watch a pastor that's acting. I could be a pastor, bro. I could be a pastor. I'm going to ask one of them, bro. Can I come in and teach them some spiritual shit, bro? I could do what you're doing. Please. Hallelujah. Man, if you don't get the fuck off the stage, big fella, you can't even meditate. Get your ass off the stage, my nigga. Fuck is wrong with you? Talking about people in here catching the Holy Ghost. Man, how much you pay this old 60 or 70 year old lady to fall on the floor like that, big fella? She didn't down there broke her motherfucking back fucking around with your acting activities. Pastor? This life crazy, dog. <laughs> and the people that feel like they have full control over their life, just trust in God. Bro, we all trust in God. He's within us at all times. Everything is fucking God, my nigga. A fingernail, a leaf, everything that you see is God, bro. God is all things. Stop looking up at some shit and look within. You looking up at a fucking illusion, my nigga. If you ain't looking at the sun, then what the fuck is you looking at? Fake clouds? <laughs> People still think they got full control, bro. Social media catch more bodies. Than bullets, bro. We all got a motherfucking social security number. We got a number on our life. We all got a number. Imagine being a human with an assigned a number when you born. I'm gonna look up more stuff about the social security and when we born too. All the shit they be doing to us when we born, cutting our biblical cord, they cutting off all our information from our past life. When they cut them cords, that's information from our past life. That's why you got to start getting in nature so you can get them Akashic records. Get all the information about yourself. Learn all about yourself. Learn thyself. Learn yourself. But you still don't think you're being controlled. You don't even know that most of this music is 440 hertz because you can't pay attention to how you feel. You will be, hey, hey. Going crazy to some 440 shit. And then your ass will walk in the house later on. Feeling moody as hell when you turn off that music. Feeling all weird and shit. Y'all still think this 440 hertz is not played. I know how I feel when I play that shit. I feel too good on a regular basis for y'all to try to trick me with some 440 hertz. Sasha, what you doing? Come here. I'm about to dip on that ass. <laughs> Doing, little girl. So, I want you to know, man, you ain't never too big for this matrix. They own this shit. This is their shit. We have to escape the matrix. The way you escape the matrix is going within, raising your vibration high enough so you won't have fear, bro. 
You need to get rid of fear. If you are scared to die, you are still being controlled. If you are, if, if your internet cut off, and at that particular moment, if your Wi-Fi cut off and you can't get on your Wi-Fi at that particular moment, you don't know what to do in your real life. You have a real life too, but you don't know what to do. You could do a million things with your real life, but you don't know how to do nothing without recording yourself for other people. <laughs> it don't count. You could go somewhere. It don't count unless you record it for your friends. Ah, you still controlled. Cut the internet off, you bored. You got anxiety, you anxious. Oh my God, well, every time Instagram go down, when the motherfucking elites is doing some information, changing some shit, probably hacking some shit. Every time Instagram go down, all you see on Twitter is a whole bunch of bots. Talk about, oh my God, Instagram. But when your power and shit cut off, you ain't gonna even be able to protect yourself or your family because you's a bot. All you know is your phone. In the 90s, they didn't have phones, bro. They didn't have phones. You had to go out and actually talk to people. We don't need internet, bro. I know our jobs is based off this shit now. This is the reality they, they created for us and this illusion that they own. But in the 90s, early 2000s, bro, you had to interact with people. You had to really get to know somebody. You didn't have all these fake girls making all these fake poses. Instagram is like a porn site now. Everything is about uh, sex and shit. It's crazy. But anyway, if you still don't think you're being controlled, man, just know they like what they know what type of women you like. They know what porn you watch. Hope you ain't watching no bullshit because they could for sure get your ass for it. They know what porn you watch. They know what type of food you like to eat. They know what type of clothes you order on a regular basis on these websites. They know what type of girls you like. They know what type of women you are seeking. They see the ones you follow. They have a full description to clone you at any time if you feel like you can't be controlled. Just know that. The only thing you can do to counter that is raise your vibration and live in love and happiness. Get rid of the fear. Notice I ain't saying nothing about fake news either. But anyway, man, so if you somebody out there that feel like you still not be in control, bro, just know whenever you got that phone in your hand and staring at yourself like this, they see you. Just know whenever you walking outside, man, them cameras that's supposed to be for Google Earth that's showing your neighborhoods, they see you. Just know when you go on these websites to go shopping, they come back and make sure they remind you, hey, come back. They see you. Understand that. Anyway, man, take care of yourself, man. I love y'all. Spiritual soul signing off.